Hey there! Welcome back. It's still wheeled tank destroyers and I've decided to go with the Lav 600. At tier 6 this is supposed to be an improvement over the Lav 300 at tier 4 so we'll find that out. Slight changes to the armor, slight changes to the visual model and just like the real life uh, unit, eh, we'll see how well it works out. Nevertheless, never driven it before, in fact I just bought it right now and we're gonna try it out. It's got camouflage on it, I put Suprina Washington in for my commander and everybody has at least one skill. So I got off-road driving, I think uh, faster rate of fire and the shrinkage on the reticle when I'm aiming. Compared to everything else, it is not spectacular in its class. I mean, six wheels, it's got that sloping sort of Lamborghini Ferrari look from the 80s. Very much a chisel with a turret on top. So, should be a decent rate of speed. Hopefully decent damage output from the gun. And very little armor. It's not designed to be a frontline fighter. And that's something I gotta keep remembering. Now, I could have went with hardcore, but once again, there's some population issues. Let's just put it that way, with hardcore. So I went down to challenging. And of course, the results here will be different than if you were to play this machine on hardcore. So, so here we're going to try and find some decent cover if we can. Oh, the depression on the front is not good. Eh, yeah, so we'll just sit here and wait. Unfortunately, Kodiak, they're going to be spawning in that general area up north. Spawning is not good here. Uh, 438. I'm running armor piercing right now because there is a high explosive shell, which was just really pitiful with penetration and damage. So, And the machine stock. Other than a repair kit and some parts, nothing. I got no... nothing. No breech loader, none of that stuff. Just running it pretty much showroom new. I keep forgetting this has a clip system. That's something I'm going to get used to. Actually, that changed a while ago, and I just... yeah. <sighs> Still, there's a few seconds between the shots for the reload, so... Uh, and of course, that sea cam is right in my way. Which is fine, so we'll try and aim for you, since you make an appearance. No pen. Still no kill. Well, let's see if this doesn't get up me into all kinds of trouble here. Try an old trick where I get a little bit better depression off the back, hopefully. But reversing up a hill is definitely not something that goes in my... It really, just have to nail... Aw, oh, come on. Don't be seen. Took a little damage to get my first kill. Uh, there we go. I also forget that I actually have to move before I can actually turn. I get used to driving track vehicles for so long that that just slipped my mind. It's not too fast right yet, so I'm assuming that the engine upgrade will really take care of that little bit of a sluggish acceleration. And of course I can't get in there. Now will this be a pain? Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Back a couple kills, take a little damage. Only a 
5,000 right now, or just under. Let's see if we can get a load on that. I am spotted by who? By you? Uh, you're just gonna get away in time, or yeah. That takes care of you. The problem I have with these machines, I always feel like a janitor. I'm just cleaning up other people's messes. And I mean, if that's the role, then that's what you do, obviously. Uh, where are you? The horrendous reload time, even though it's on a clip system. I've already taken a little too much damage for my liking. And... yeah. Still, I can deal out decent damage. Come on, load. There we go. Come on. Uh, no lieutenant for me. Oh, I can kill a building. Or the remains of one. So what are we looking at? Six seconds, four shot clip. Would really help if you can get him to turn sideways. Like, oh, come on. There we go. There we are, 75, 68. So let's get out of here, see if we can get over out of that secondary. Hopefully nobody has spawned. And get my uh, gun a chance to reload here. Definitely not very fast at this stage of things. Mind you, once it does get up and going, it goes pretty decently. Can I actually? Yes, I can. Nice. Tag that in. Now that last one, that could be a real obstacle here. It depends on just how thick they are. There's one. Don't let anybody be spawned around this corner here. Oh, a sea can in the way. Okay, well, you know what? <gasps> no, a weasel toad. Ah, uh, swing fire. Come on. Come on, take it. There we go. Got a weasel toad. Ah! And I'm all the way back here. Come on. That one last secondary. Don't kill him. Let's get it, guys. Let's get the bonuses. Figure out what I was up to. And go for it. And an auto cannon, which will rip me to shreds. <sighs> really? We're not going to get that secondary. Yeah, I don't even have the E option to get that little, like, scoot. No, no, no. No. Come on. There we go. Ten kills. Broke 10,000. Did not get the secondaries. And even for challenging, I mean... Because you don't have armor, you have to play really careful, and unfortunately I didn't, and I died. Paid for it. But it is a times four, so if I was actually going to use this vehicle for progression to the next one, it would come in handy. However, I've already got the next vehicle, so I'm good to go. So this is more of a showcase of how not to play it. Find a good place to go, use cover... Take careful shots, and remember that it's six seconds between your four shots for a full reload on your clip. The funny thing is, even though I just have it, I already have progress on it. And I'll show you why in just a second here. I'm going to say I came in, well, blue star, I'm number one. There we are, so. This is where it gets kind of interesting. I have bought no upgrades for this. See, everything is stock, except for improved 
gun breach. Now I've already unlocked this on another vehicle, so does the progress of it transfer to this? And it gave me like I think 20% or how much did it give me? 20% right off the bat. And now with this little battle that I got underneath me, it's already given me 60,000. I can't explain it. Has this happened to you? Have you bought a vehicle and all of a sudden you've got like 10, 20, even 30% just already accumulated towards your next vehicle? Wow. So if you sat through all that babbling, by all means give yourself a thumbs up. If you got anything out of this or was entertained by my little adventure and getting blown sky high, give me a thumbs up, consider subscribing to my channel, leave comments in the section below. How could I play that different? Oh, the list is endless. I could have pick better cover, been a little more cautious on how I maneuver myself around the map, maybe supported someone with a little bit more frontal armor than what I've got, so the fire was directed towards them and not towards me. Leave your tips and hints in the section below and I'll mull it over the next time I roll out the Lab 600 Tier 6 Wheeled Tank Destroyer. Thanks for watching, and until next time, take care.